Hello inventors, this is Soro. In this video, we will learn how we can implement OTP login functionality in our Android app. So you can see that's our app here. You have to put your mobile number with country code. Okay, so let me put my country code and then I have to put my number. Now click on get OTP and wait some seconds. You can see here that's uh, OTP. Uh, okay, you need to copy this. And now you have to put that OTP, this one, and then click on verify. OTP verified successfully. So we will use your Codular. Okay. So open Codular. We will use your Firebase free SMS. They will provide us around 10,000 free SMS. So let's use Codular to create this functionality. Create apps. Click on it. Now we need to click on create project option. Here you can see click on it and our project name is TCB OTP app and then next then finish so I will use your one simple layout vertical arrangement layout general and you will find your vertical arrangement this one and make this one with height fill parent wait a second and I have to because I have to use one more uh, layout here so I will drag and drop one more layout here vertical arrangement like this one okay and I have to make both of them like width and height is automatic sorry not fill parent okay now we need to drag and drop here some first thing is text box and one button so you can just type your text box or you will find this text box here this one drag and drop it here and drag and drop one button here like this Okay, this is for getting the OTP from uh, in our mobile number on our phone and in the next here we will use your one button and we will use your one more text box to verify our OTP. Okay, so that's our second screen. That's our first screen and we will use one more screen. So I will add here this click on add screen option screen to and create after verification if the OTP is right then we will move and we will redirect our user to screen 2 okay it means after a sign up we will move that welcome screen to our user now we will use here simply like one label here and just type here something like where value is good job something like that and i'm going to make this one hide and fill fill parent make it at least 50 now uh, let's open the fourth screen okay this one okay now we need to use vertical arrangement and we need to make it center we need to make it also center and we have to do again for this also center and center we will use one simple space okay to make this uh, layout good uh, here space this one is space between both like this and in that button text we will use your get OTP get OTP and in the second we will use your verify verify OTP right now we need to hide first screen it means vertical arrangement but I am to make this background color to something like a background color you can choose anything like this one set this right and here fine and then we need to use this one also vertical arrangement verify sorry background color is also tell something like that yes cool now we need to hide this vertical arrangement to visual make it visual off and whenever someone put their here number so we have to just type here mobile number with country code like this okay this text will display in that uh, text box okay so whenever someone put our number with the country code and click on get otp so we will get one otp so we have to do code for this so first of all we will create the account in our firebase so open firebase dot google dot com go to the console you have to create your account in the firebase then we need to click on add project our project name is suppose tcb otp verification okay and click on continue disable create project 
okay so that account is created now we need to click on that android you can see android click on this and we have to put our android package name okay so go to the code builder here okay and click on that screen and scroll down click on that advanced properties okay and you can see the package name okay so you have to put something like that you can put anything like uh, you can say tcb uh, or you can say otp dot tcb app dot com okay this should be unique okay otp dot tcb app dot com that's my package name you can put anything anything here right no problem now you have to copy this package name like that and go to the here and you have to put your uh, that package name now we have to put our app name so tcb otp app like this now we have to use your sha okay debian signing key so go to the code ruler. here you can see the uh, setting option this one account go to the setting option here and you will find here that key you have to copy that key and go to the tcb here and paste it here now click on registered app now we need to click on download google service.json file okay this is important and we need to do one correction in this file okay because whenever i upload this file in the code ruler i'm not able to export uh, my apk file okay so how we can solve this error so let me just show you we have to open this file in any editor okay so let me just open this in base code and here you need to put one line now you can see here after this okay after project number you have to put this line this one firebase url okay and you have to put your app name so you can see the project id this one copy this and just paste it here like this okay that's your app name okay so that's the url you have to put uh, and in your file you have to put your app name okay like this one project id and then firebase io.com this is important okay and then save this file okay now you can see uh, you have make sure this should be renamed like uh, this should not be this should be because I uh, already have that file that's why this name is too so I will remove this so my file name is google dash service dot json and that's the code okay now let's uh, what I will do here go to the code ruler and we need to cross it and you can see the assets then click on upload assets and you have to upload that file this one and wait some second yeah upload it cross it right now let's complete the file risk process okay click next click next and then click on again next and continue to console okay now in the left side you will find authentication click on this get started right you can see the sign in method and you can see the phone we have to enable this click on this make sure this will be enabled and make it save okay cool that is fine now let's go to the code reader now we have uploaded our file here in the assets this one now cross it now go to the block now we have to code so whenever someone click on that button okay button one then we have to get the otp so oh go to the design we need one extension here so here you will find the extension click on google and you will find your firebase authentication this one drag and drop this this one is also non-visual component so go to the block and click on that extension here this one firebase and you will find your get the uh, phone number you will find your this one this one phone number sign in phone number this one okay now you have to use phone number so your phone number is in the that box text box one dot text okay and make sure this should be with your country code okay if your number is suppose your, you live in India and your number is uh, 88888 then you have to put plus 91 then 8888 it means your number okay so you have to use plus sign then your country code is mean 91 plus 91 and or something other plus whatever your country code and then you have to put your number okay now this is for getting the OTP now whenever we click on that button so we have to hide this vertical arrangement one okay this one should be visible off 
false and we have to make enable to our vertical arrangement to should be enable to should be true right and on that button to click okay on that button to click we have to check the uh, code okay so what i will do here click on fire weather authentication and you will find your verify otp phone number code verify phone code okay and the code we will get in we will use that text box two dot text this one okay now after successfully uh, successful verification then click on fire application and you will find your the login success okay so whenever the login is success we have to redirect this to the another screen it means uh, open another screen just type here open another screen this one select this open a screen and you have to put your uh, screen name so use text box and your screen name is screen 2 scr double n2 right simple now you can do a lot more things here like uh, you have you can verify the user okay so suppose you can say like control if okay first thing whenever someone try to verify their account so if the if the text box one logic use this one if the text box one dot text is nothing or you can say the null text box one is is not equal to null okay it means something is there then we will redirect them then we will use this functionality otherwise we, we can display the error also okay so whenever someone try to click on without putting their number so we will do nothing here or we can use your else part also to display some error okay so after this successful verification we will use our button to verify a phone code okay phone code okay and that's the code and after successful uh, verification we will redirect that user to the this screen screen 2 okay so that's the overall and simple code to otp login verification using codular okay so if you have some doubt you can ask me on command thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye